Hello, hello everyone. Welcome back guys. Welcome back to our little adventures here. So what we have here is a second episode of Bannerolt Online. Let's go and join that fight. So what's, what happens guys? I'll uh, brief you on what's going on in the meantime. So yeah, last episode, if you watched the last episode, you probably know that I haven't managed to actually save my progress when I was buying bits and bobs. So I was buying bits and bobs from um, the trader in the city and uh, unfortunately, you know, nothing could have been purchased uh, because it did not save. So what I did basically before getting to this episode here, I've gone there, I've uh, replayed that bit when I bought bits and bobs again and then bought myself this armor and hired a few men in the city, okay? So hired a few men in the city. Oh, gives us morale and tactic experience. Great. So hired them. And now we have a little tiny party. But the quest says I need to go to a tavern. Okay. And speak to Godric. So let's go and do that. Yeah, we are a um, company of five men. Myself included. I also bought myself that old horse. And so now hope, hopefully finally that we are armed and armored. Let's talk to him. So that is completed and I think I think we're gonna do something else with him now let's see have become more fr more frequent a rumor has it that, that the bandits have set up a camp okay and the da -da 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 will provide so okay we need to destroy uh, the camp it seems going out of town right, right now to track them I think that's for a small fee we can hire several imperial recruits you can often be found on the cities hired people need food you can buy it oh okay in the markets of the cities or you can make it yourself i'll give you a supply for a couple of days but keep an eye on it yourself from now on okay food yeah i don't know how to do it hire three fighters and follow me okay let's do that i think i already hired them but hey uh so we need to i guess go to the surroundings ah here you are my horsey horse which is great yeah i'm very happy i have it so it's gonna be a little bit quicker you know moving around so yeah oh what i also did i went to the mines you you know and mine some more uh ore and got some more money let's see if i can hire these guys uh i don't need any more yeah i think i already hired enough i had like five so yeah did some mining of the ore i didn't record it because you know you already seen this if you've seen episode one it's there but uh, i will do some recording if i go and do some agricultural work you know or if i do some uh, uh market now yeah let's see if i do some um something else something different you know that should be interesting to see and i'll record that let's see what we can have here ancient coins by the way i don't know if this is the place to buy food oh wheat yes okay it seems so he gave me some bread i don't know if the wheat is possible to turn into bread should be the uh the case right so guys yeah if you have any advice at all then oh royal stew Hmm, interesting yeah then please do let me know in the comments okay I, again i'm totally new to this like for example there are some sets of armor noble ball uh oh look kettle hat of a male oh and it's so light actually it's lighter than mine mine is yeah look at that 3.1 this one is only 2.9 but it's yeah much more expensive selected raw meat yeah oh bread oh let's let's get one more bread then okay oh yeah that's fine Let's get that. Yeah, for example, I wanted to ask, like, you have pole sword. Oh, pole sword would be great, actually. How much was it? Wow, no, no, no. Can't afford that at the moment. Uh, yeah, yeah, this one. Does anyone know what this is? It's only 4,000. It seems great noble warrior upgrade kit. Like, what, what does it do? I just don't want to go spend the money, then discover, oh, actually, that is something totally unrelated to me at this stage. Yeah, and this is another one. If anyone could let me know, guys, what does it actually mean? Because it seems it's cheaper than buying all these bits and bobs independently, you know, uh, separately. So if you know, please do enlighten me in the, poll, in the comments, okay? As to what is going on with this. And this bread is somehow different from the bread that he gave me. Oh, mule. I think I need mule, don't I? Yeah, I think I will need some mules because I think I need to increase capacity, I, I, I read somewhere. So yeah, guys, uh, just please comment if you have anything to, uh, you know, uh, teach me. That'd be much, much appreciated. Oh, there you go, the mule. Ooh, 15k. Shall we just buy one mule? Mule does allow something. Carrying capacity 50. Let's get that. L look, I still have 50k anyway. 
Yeah, let's do that. Done. All right, leave. I think now, uh, let's check. I think I'm done now. I think I need to go and talk to, uh, to him in a tavern again. Oh, no, he disappeared. Okay, so there's no one here. Oh, no, there is someone. Who is this? A th thief or we'll come back to him. Imperial crossbowman. I think I cannot hire him. Yeah, I already have enough enough men right so let's have a look uh, so that's my party so I have one Imperial recruit and then the rest I have this guy and couple of uh, Imperial infantrymen let's see so what, what am I to do uh, Godric is waiting near the bandit camp to the east okay to the east okay let's go and see where is the east east should be here somewhere let's go find out oh boy oh boy oh boy no that is way way too bad Right, where is it? To the east. To the east, okay. That is east, isn't it? Ah, there you go, that's the hideout. Right, let's let's see. Ah, that's Godric right there. Let's go and talk to him. Yeah, let's see what he's going to tell us. Alright, I scouted out the hideout. Ten people scattered. Okay, yeah, alright, let's do that. Oh, 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 Jesus Christ. This guy's almost gained on me. There's 19 of them. Okay, let's go. Where is Godric? Is it just me? That's not nice. Where is he? Where is he? Where is his man? All right. All right. Ah, I'm basically screwed, guys. All right. So that is not going to be nice. He didn't show. Okay, he didn't show. It seems. It's just me on my old horse that is barely moving. Okay. Uh, faced by the bunch of um, looters of which, yeah, already killed one of my men. Okay. So, yeah, yeah, Godric, where are you? Uh, no idea. Okay, guys, I think I'm pretty much, yeah, pretty screwed here. Okay, I think I'm screwed. So they killed the second man, and that is pretty much done. Let's retreat. Okay, so that was not available in the battle mode. Are you kidding me? Right, so basically we cannot leave, it seems. Yeah, okay, so the only option I have is to surrender. Okay, let's do that. I don't know what else I can do now. Surrender, you will lose your troops. Yeah, well, well, what choice do I have? Ah, oh, there he is. No, that's somebody else. That's somebody else. What the hell happened there? I have no idea. Someone got in, in, uh, involved in my fight, it seems. Oh, well, that is very, very helpful, uh, sir. Kind sir. I'm uh, very grateful. And he's brought some archers. Oh, wow, he's got a lot of archers. And should be doing short work of these uh, looters, hopefully. Let's see if we can just... Oh, bugger. I probably need a shield. But, you know, I'm kind of torn between what kind of character to have. Whether I should have a character, you know, like a lancer with bow and arrow and... Um, bow and arrow and... Oh, jeez. And, um, you know, and uh, one-handed. Or whether I should have a shield and something else so like whether i should be basically a cataphract in an eastern style with a bow and arrow a lance and a one-handed a mace or something well not now in the future now i have no money for any of that or whether i should actually you know uh, have a shield and then everything else that comes with it oh gosh they killing some of my men was it my guy ah let's go 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 hey 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 easy fellas easy easy Let's go and see what we can do here. We, oh, there, there, he killed that guy. Ah. Yeah, his horse is not the greatest either. It's quite, quite slow. But his archers doing all the work. So these looters, you know, if they had any sense whatsoever, they would have fled by now. <laughs> but they don't. Ah, I killed one guy. Wow, 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 look at that. And did we get anything? Morale, yeah. Experience and tactics. Thank you, thank you. Whoever that is saved me here, basically. Ah, oh, look at that nice little loot here as well. Oh, this we can actually use. There you go. Excellent. Right, so where is this Godric Schmodric? Hang on, before we attack, equip, let's see. What does it say? Attack the bandit camp. Yeah, well, I did attack it and I already lost all my troops, didn't I? And this Baldric Godric never showed up so i don't know what to do now i'm gonna go and see if i can hire more men would be nice to be able to sell this uh loot as well oh no i do have men okay well that's great yeah that's great i cannot sort them out oh there you go okay that's much better right let's see if this godric is here now probably not 
No. Right, let's check what we have in terms of character. Oh, yes. This hasn't saved last time either, actually. Um, so, yeah, let's do with social. That's one. And what else can I do here? Steward, one-handed, two-handed. Uh, control. Yeah, let's do uh, this one. Okay, that's great. So, yeah, we'll go with the social and then we'll go with this one. Cunning, there you go. Right. Oh, we have tactics eight, leadership one. I also gained some two-handed when I was mining and some athletics as well, nine. Wow, okay. So not too bad, leadership's one and trade is none. So I need to work towards it. Let's see, in terms of party. Uh, yeah, I'm at the, at the limit now. Actually, I need one more man because one seemed to have been killed. Let's see if I can get one of those higher tiers. Artisan, what does artisan do? Let's have a look. I have unwanted items for sale. Yes, exactly. Oh, look at the pricey price. Not too bad, huh? Leather shoes. Oh, how many of this am I have? And, oh, that's a nice price. 315, that's great. And it doesn't lock, actually, for some reason. I try and lock in it. Doesn't work. Oh, that's great. So I know a little bit better now how to get rid of unwanted items. So found this guy, says Stuart of Western Empire. Let's go and see if we can talk to him. See what he offers, what kind of services. Tell me about the clan system in this land. I would like to form my own. Ah, okay. No, I don't think I need any of that for now. And it's funny how my horse changes color. I think it was black in the previous scene and now it's white again. It was white when I purchased it as well, I think. <laughs> Interesting. Can't seem to find any higher tier troops. It's only Imperial recruits everywhere. Must have been all hired out because last time I was here, when I was doing off screen some of this playing to kind of restore where I was in my episode one, there were plenty of them. They were standing all around. Look at that, three million. Camel, oh my god, 600,000 if you wanted Christmas camel. <laughs> Christmas camel. <laughs> Unique named Stallion. Wow, two mils, all right. Um, so basically, uh, any of that. If you want any half decent horse, yeah, this is the one I've got. Uh, and if you want a saddle, it's another 20k. Yeah, it will set you back 20k, 22. Yeah, I think I need to upgrade my riding skills, it seems, before I can buy anything decent here. Ragged saddle. Shall I just buy one? How much is it? What does it look like? Let's have a look. Oh my god, yeah, it's a disgrace, isn't it? <laughs> I guess it's better than none. Uh, this one is slightly... Oh, it looks like a Roman, you know, these four horns. A Roman military saddle, but it's like 3k difference. Uh, and it's only horse armor 8, only horse armor 9. But slightly l uh, lighter though. Right, why don't we just... Yeah, let's just buy one. Why not? Oh, look, there's a pumpkin for sale. I don't know. What on earth would I do with that? Oh, it's a head armor. <laughs> hilarious. Absolutely hilarious. Okay. It seems that my health has been restored while I, I was hanging around this place. Oh, there's one. There you go. Imperial Archer, yes, there you go. That's fine. So one spawned. These two clans are battling it out, it seems, over there. Okay. Ah, Forest Bandits. Yeah, that hideout, I don't think I can, you know, take on an, on that hideout. Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait a second, wait a second. Let's take on this guy. These Sea Raiders, traditionally, they have the best armor, don't they? The best loot. Let's see, maybe he'll drop something decent. There you go. Attack, everyone charge. Yes. Oh, I forgot to put the saddle on. Uh, yeah, you see he's got a spear and he's... Oh, and he's got... Uh, <laughs> yeah, that is dangerous. Yeah, those javelins, they could be deadly. Yeah, he's got a spear, he's got a shield and he's absolutely has no brain because he's just facing me and chasing me. <laughs> and I have a hundred... Actually, it's quite profitable, you know, and good fun. You gain so much experience. So maybe I'll just do that. I'll just do looters and uh well didn't drop any loot oh why is this in red caravan right it's still a daytime let's go and see if i can do some farming show you some farming in this episode let's go to the village oh, there's no one here it seems that it's again the wrong village oh there is a work oh okay healing planting blah 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 good come to me for a wage calculation when you want to finish your work okay will do so where do we go now there's no one here absolutely no one doing anything let's go find those tools or whatever we need to have aha found the seeds let's see what we can do with them so i grab those seeds i suppose okay 
Tools and weapons can be thrown away by pressing the key G. Yes. Okay, great. So what do we do now? So I've got that. Now what? Do I need to go now and take tools as well? Ah, tools are there, over there. Impossible. Ah, damn, it's my horse. I cannot even climb. Let's go and get some tools then. Oh, hang on. What was it? Ready to collect. Oh, gosh. There's plenty of ripe stuff here. No one's harvesting, it seems. Ah, yeah, I took the wrong thing, it seems. So let's go some harvesting, yeah. Because it seems that there's plenty is already ready for collection. Let's do that. Yeah, and if I'm doing anything wrong, guys, you can please, yeah, enlighten me. Ah, there you go. Right, 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 okay. Ah, it's terribly slow, though. I wish I could move a little bit quicker. That would be great. That's terribly, terribly slow mo motion. Slow mo. Okay. All right, that's fine. That's fine. Let's see. <laughs> it's, it's, it's good fun, I guess, you know. But easier way, actually, to make it money than perhaps even in vanilla game. All right, one more. Aha, uh -huh. so that's earned 200. Where do I put it? Do I go and put it here somewhere? Yes. Okay. Oh, great. Okay, that's fantastic. So, guys, okay. I think I'll, I'll spend a while here. There's something already growing, so I'll, I'll harvest that. See what can be done. So, that's basically harvesting, reaping. Okay. Then I want to see if I can also, once that is finished, if I can uh, actually plant. That'd be nice. I think mining is a bit more fun, though. Uh, it's not as a slow mo as this one. And also uh, gives you, you know, uh, two handed and stuff. So I think I'm going to take a hole and go and do some planting now because I've done a bit of um, harvesting, but it's quite far away, you know, uh, reaping. I guess we'll start from this side because this is where the prepare the soil. OK, yeah, this is where the grains are, the seeds. Sorry. Let's see. So how does that work? OK, right. Ah, OK, that's nice. Looks like a pile of dunk. <laughs> okay. Did I miss? All right. There's another one here. Oh, someone's fighting somebody. Uh, that's going to be a nice... No, no, it's not going to be nice. It's going to be ugly looking raw of, <laughs> of soil. So let's do one, one more row here. And then we're going to go and see if we can get the seeds and plant them and see what happens there. Right. So the soil has been prepared. Let's see. Let's check this hole and let's take some of the seeds. Let's see if we can actually plant. There you go. Okay, nice. Nice. Look at this. Aha. Uh -huh. The only problem will be perhaps it's not going to be, you know, uh, harvesting season as of yet. It's probably going to probably sprout it with uh, watering is required. Okay, yes, yes. Okay, so we need to water as well. This better pay a lot of money because mining was actually quite all right. It's funny and uh, the hand movement as if he's tying a knot or something. Right. So there you have it. We planted the seeds. Now water is required. Let's go grab some water. Let's get one of these jugs. And where is the river now? Oh, no. River is quite far off. Oh, boy. I wonder if there would be a field. And my horse, unfortunately, yeah, cannot remount it. Impossible to saddle. Yeah, and I need to put the saddle on it, actually. I totally forgot about this. All right, jug is full. Oh, at least there's only one press of a button with mining. You know, when you unload the uh, ore that you gathered, you, you can actually, you know, you cannot just unload the whole thing with one press of a button. You have to push every single time. Oh, at least it's not just, you know, one jug per bush. Oh, that's good. That's handy. Right. Right, so this is sprouted wheat. Aha, uh -huh. and this one, ah, uh, so that's easy to see. You know, this, this this blue thing pops up when it hasn't been watered yet, I suppose. Yeah, like so. Ah, that's good. Okay, that's easy. Easy to determine where the water should actually go. Oh, look, it's ready for harvesting already. Oh, that's great. I was hoping that it would happen. I wasn't sure if, you know, I will need to just abandon it uh, because it won't be ready. But actually, I'll water everything and then, yeah, start harvesting. That is great. So... And then we'll see how much we're earning because there's no one here. It seems that it's not a very, not a very, perhaps. Oh, there's one more here. Lucrative business, it seems, because where is, where's everyone, right? So let's go, let's dump this and let's get sickle and let's go back. Yeah, they nicely, nicely getting, getting, you know, grown. Yeah, by the time I do this end, hopefully the other end will be ready for collection as well, for harvesting. 
Right, let's go back, drop that and see if the far end is getting ready. Oh yes, everything's ready now to be harvested. Great. Right, so we gathered everything. It's actually quite a nice chilled kind of, you know, spending of your time. You come from work, tired, you go do some harvesting, <laughs> you know, or mining or what have you, earn some money. The money was actually okay with the, with the ore. Now here we will see, I think I need to see the headsman again. And then we'll see what we're earning. So it will be made and we'll be able to determine whether it's worth coming here or, or just going to this ore few villages. Or there's a forestry available, uh, lumber as well, I think. I want to do that as well at some point. Oh, someone's arriving. Hello, an adventurer. This guy does not know what he's doing. <laughs> That's done. Yeah, they don't know. These guys don't know what they're doing, it seems like me. All right, let's go talk to this guy. Headsman, where is he? Let's see. About the work you gave me, you earned... Is that it? Ah, no, that wasn't worth it, was it? Let's see if I can remount my horse, or do I just leave and the horse is uh, automatically going to be given to me, or what, what have you? Let's have a look. Oh, yeah, I can mount it. Okay, now we can leave. I wonder what would have happened. Guys, what would happen in, uh, with the horse if I just left the scene? Would I lose the horse? If anyone knows, please enlighten me. And overall, it seems my impression is actually all mining was quicker, quicker making money, isn't it? Is it? Am I am I right to assume that? Um, oh boy, there's 15 of these guys here. Am I right to assume that ore is more profitable, guys, to this, if you could let me know? Because it seems that he, they didn't pay me that much. Didn't pay me much at all for what I was doing, for the amount of time spent, you know? Maybe we should have attacked this hideout at night. I don't know if I made a mistake. And where is this Godric guy anyway? I think I'm going to wrap this episode up here now. Thanks a lot for joining. Please leave a comment if you know anything about this game at all. Anything I'm doing right, anything I'm doing wrong. My impression so far, mining in this place is much more profitable than, you know, farming here. And I'm going to next episode, I'm going to, I want to come to this place and do some uh, lumbering and forestry and all the rest of that so i'll see you guys in the next one thanks again and take care